Women leaders from seven local government units in Ora County in Zombo District have been challenged to embrace presidential initiative on jobs and wealth creation. This was revealed by Honorable Kushin Grace Freedom during the sensitization of women on how to embrace government programs so as to empower the women in rural areas. During the meeting held to Warokemo Primary School playing ground, Zombo District, Honorable Kushin Grace urged the women leaders to change narratives of other women on government programs like Uganda Women Empowerment Program, OEP, Parish Development Model, PDM, M Yoga, among others. From the parish level, in the county and in the district, we had women leaders, we had religious leaders, we had women councillors and women council at all levels. When we came to do a follow-up, a monitoring of government programs, how they were faring, according to what the Prime Minister directed us to do, when I met the women, they told me that they have been elected into leadership, but they do not know their roles, and they do not know what to talk about. They don't know what government is doing. And that really sent a message into my heart, and I thought, let me come back, for a one-day meeting, and then we sensitize them about government programs and what they can do about uh, support to government programs and to themselves, because all government programs are for the people. Our policy, our government policy, is a pro-people policy. So all what government is doing is for the betterment of the people. Like the PDM, is for economic empowerment of the people. It's also for the increased production for the people, so that they can have uh, food, but they can also have income. And they can process and add value for some of the bulk production, so that they can get better income. Meanwhile, Samuel Ochake, Zombo District Community Development Officer, said they have registered drastic improvement in enrollment of women to access government programs through community sensitization like Hell Today. It asks the women to be responsible to take care of their families. And within the private sector. And that's why you also can see we have Uganda Development Bank also here as an institution that can support women entrepreneurs to build their own capacities and businesses. So basically we are here on an empowerment mission to ensure we give our women information, information that can help them build their own businesses, that can help them start their own businesses, but above all to ensure that our women, our grassroots women can build income, can improve on their household income and therefore improve on their general livelihoods because we know development starts at the family level. However, Uyulu James Rona, Zumbu District Chairperson, remarked that over 300 women leaders received OEP and PDM funds and is optimistic that the women will perform better than men who do not value government programs. <laughs> Many <laughs> Wangu nishako ibang ibang gadit para chia manjo ne goyo paka nishi di izomotan council ma eno de wakwe te financial year mwe binu eni wabe shi gero ma eno de wakato kona chia washi to kona echa don limoku mania ya climate smart agriculture no. Grace team, the deputy RDC Zombo district, revealed that government has introduced several programs to help vulnerable women who cannot afford paying school fees and businesses. She urged Zombo women to appreciate the president of Uganda, 
His Excellency Yorika Kutama Seveni for eradicating poverty from each household. The women leaders from Ora constituency converged here. We were reawakening them on what the government has on the ground for them. We brought, we made them to know that the government is... So this Baraza deal really came and One thing that really touched me the most is the way uh, PDM has been taken up by our community. In fact, now we are almost at 90% in disbursement of the, 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 other, the money that was given us for last financial year. And the leaders have also benefited. So now we have informed, we have told them that it is their role as leaders to see this uh, PDM succeed in the community. Because they, they have to be exemplary. They have to show the people that what the government has given them is a seed capital that can multiply. Among the dignitaries who attended the meeting include officials from Uganda Development Bank, Shapasons Local Council 3 in Ora County, women leaders among others, Alfred Jawok, West Nile TV, Nile Cast.